Hello, welcome to a new Creature tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to introduce to you a new type of leg motor called the reverse foot motor. And what this does is it allows you to easily animate leg or foot motion with accurate ground contact. So let's get started. It's very actually very simple to use. So this will be a rather short tutorial. You'll see in a moment how easy it is to use. So what you do is it works on three leg bones, exactly exactly three bones. So in this example, I have a character here, a ninja character. I'm going to select the foot bone and, th and then I'm going to walk up the bone chain like so. So now I have three bones, right, selected. And all I need to do is move my, my mouse over to install motor and pick reverse foot motor. And <laughs> there you have it, it's installed. Now, when you select the, the motor, the, the legs with the reverse foot motor installed, you will see a couple of things. One, you'll see this line visualization here. This denotes the ground plane, okay? And then there's a couple other things. You have two widget handles here. This will actually, if you drag it, this will control yeah, this will control the overall pulls of the leg and the end widget allows you to tilt your foot. Now obviously this, this foot pose looks ridiculous because the character in question is actually a human being and not some kind of animal. <laughs> so what you do is you can just come over here and flip the IK angles so I can flip it to say negative and there you have it. Now this is more like what you have, right? A typical foot motion from a person. Now you notice if I, as I drag the, the leg down, you notice as it hits the ground, there's, there's actually ground contact. So the foot actually self adjusts to be perfectly aligned to the ground as you hit the ground. Pretty cool, huh? So this actually means you can easily, very easily animate any kind of custom leg running motion without worrying about ground contact because the foot will actually automatically place itself and align itself with the ground, the visualization here, yeah? So you can change the Y, the Y position of the ground very easily. It's just an attribute value. So I can just say, you know, set another value. Let's say minus 15, negative 15, that's where we get. So now the ground is lower. So as, as you can see, I can move the foot lower, but as I hit the ground, it self adjusts. I think a value of say negative 14.5 might be better, right? Because that's what we want. Let's, let's see, there you go. Maybe negative 14.2 maybe, there you go. Okay, so we can actually easily see the ground contact. Now, the other thing I, I mentioned to you is the other control over here allows you to actually adjust the tilt of your feet. So you can actually, let's, let me show you, if I actually move it like this, like so. So you see how, what, see what it does? So as it hits the ground, actually again, self adjusts for ground contact, but when you lift it up, it will then revert back to the orientation of your desired foot. And that's really all it is. So you can keyframe these so I can show you. So let's say we start with this pose. I step forward, say seven frames. I move over here and then I can say adjust the foot orientation. And then say at frame 15, I lower the foot and notice how it, notice how it actually aligns with the ground for ground contact. And if I step through the frames, you can see that it does very natural foot motion, right? So again, very powerful motor. This actually allows you to do many, many things, including very easily animating your custom walk cycle. So now you have another arsenal in your bag of tricks with Creature. So you can use the reverse foot motor to very easily animate custom foot motion that you wouldn't normally be able to do with just the cycle motors themselves. So that's really all it is for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. This is a very powerful, very powerful motor that you can use to animate custom leg motion. At the same time, it's extremely easy to use. It's super simple to use, right? So I hope you will use this motor for all your custom leg motions and have fun animating. Thanks for watching.